Hi. I haven't done an update in a really long time, and I wanted to give an update for anyone who is looking for information on Cushing syndrome. Maybe you were just diagnosed yourself, and you know that you need an adrenalectomy. Maybe you've been through it, and you're wondering, like, how you're gonna feel. I haven't. I wasn't able to find very many videos, very much information from people's personal experience. So I wanted to give an update today. I am six months post uh, left adrenalectomy from Cushing syndrome. And I wanted to be real and share with you how I feel, which from the people I've talked to is pretty typical. Um, I still have good days and bad days or not so good days, I like to say, but the not so good days are becoming less and less. The doctor had said to me over and over, be patient, be patient, be patient. Six months is when you'll start to notice that you'll feel better. And about two weeks ago, I definitely started to notice um, improvements um, that I just was able to do more. I didn't get that unexplainable, like no words for it level of exhaustion that you're probably feeling. Um, exhaustion isn't even come close to being the right word. So um it doesn't happen as much. Now I'm often exhausted, just exhausted like we all get sometimes or tired. Um, the nausea and dizziness is way, way, way less. Um, I'm able to exercise more. Um, I'm starting to do like small hikes. Um, I'm just trying to think. Um, yeah, overall I'm slowly improving, but it is a process. And if you're going through this, just know that you need to be patient and that take it one day at a time and just be kind to yourself, be patient, um, be easy on yourself because it is a slow process. Um, you might wonder about the weight too. Um, I'm finally starting to lose some weight, but it's still slow. But he had told me that that would be typical as well. So I've lost about 20 pounds now. Um, but that's been for six months. So I really thought that would come off faster too, but it hasn't, but I'm optimistic that it will come off now. So, um, yeah, hopefully that is helpful and informative for anyone going through this, because like I said, I know that I was looking for information and never hesitate to reach out to me if you have questions, because I know that you want support during this. It's kind of not, not an easy diagnosis. So, all right. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.